As we get older, balance becomes more and more important. That's for falls prevention and, in addition, maintaining our bone density, our muscle mass is also fantastic for falls prevention as well as all the other health benefits. Today we're going to chat to some of the participants from Balance and Bones and I've got with me at the moment Peter. Hi Peter. Hi, how are you? So tell me Peter, what do you get out of this class? I've gained so much strength. Um, I've had two knee replacements and my recovery from them has been excellent because of the strength I've built up in knees and shoulders and arms. Um, I'm so much stronger, I'm so much more confident. Um, if I don't do it, I really feel the difference. So it's been fabulous. Can we ask how old you are? Yes, I'm 71. Okay, awesome. Now if someone's sitting at home, maybe they're in their 71, 70s, whatever, and they've never tried doing hand weights or ankle weights before, what would you say to someone watching us today? Just start. You don't have to start with weights. You can start without weights and then just go to a very one kilo and then gradually work up as you get better and stronger. Um, and the difference, I've recommended heaps of people to come and do this. And at first they poo-hooed it and said, oh, no, no, it doesn't do anything for me. And I said to them, just wait, give it a few months and just see what happens because the difference is absolutely fantastic. And how do you find doing it on Zoom? I love Zoom. Um, I miss very much coming to the classes and the girls and chatting and talking, coffee afterwards. But um, Zoom has been marvellous and we've got so many more participants and it's always a bit of fun still. We have a chat beforehand and, and then we start the class and um, it's just been fantastic. Hi, Helen. Hi Carol, thank Welcome you for inviting me. So you're 82, is that right? Yes. Um, so you're a fantastic example to everyone that, you know, doesn't matter how old you are, you can start doing this work. Yes. And tell us about the age range of your participants. 70s up to 95. Wow. Oh, and it doesn't matter because everybody's, you know, working differently depending on the weights they're lifting for themselves. I do a lot of gardening and um, I've painted the house and I don't think I could have done it without the strength I've got from using the weights. I told Helen that too. And, and have you noticed any other benefits? I just, I walk better. I think I, um, and my attitude is, is good. So even if you only do it twice a week, you can have lots of benefits from it. Oh, absolutely. Uh, the other benefit is that people who are going in for elective orthopaedic surgery have very good outcomes because they're going into the operation strong. Um, and I'm getting reports back from the physios and surgeons who are just absolutely amazed at how well they recover post-op. And I didn't have um, orthopaedic surgery, but I have had some surgery. And again, they've been amazed at how quickly I got over the surgery and bounced back. Yes, yeah, so it's really important leading up to the surgery to do it as well as post-surgery. Yes. yes. It's brilliant. And mm. you feel so much better doing it too. Mm. And I do put an emphasis on stretching, not just for the sake of the muscles to be doing the work, but to maintain as much flexibility in the joints as possible. Mm. I mean, just reaching up to a cupboard, for example, to get something off a high shelf, that's terribly important to people. Being able to get down, pick something off the floor, just get walk up a couple of steps. Yes. All that's so important. It's all about us living independently as long as possible right. in our homes yes. And, yes. And, and having that flexibility, that mobility, that strength to do that. That's right. That's yes, okay. yes. And we've got Anne-Marie here. Now, Anne-Marie, what? how did you find out about balance and bones? Well, I, re I retired earlier than I wanted to for health reasons and um, I was just looking around for something to do. And I had a history of falls, I'd had a lot of falls. So I thought bones and balance would help in that area. Have you noticed any improvement? Yeah, I, well, I probably haven't had a fall now for 18 months, which is, that's really good, because they were very frequent. So you really understand the importance of falls prevention because yep. you've been down that road yourself with yes. multiple falls. Have you noticed any other benefits from doing it? It's nice and social. I've met lots of people through U3A, that's been nice. And what would you say to someone at home thinking about giving it a go? Maybe they're a bit concerned about falls as well. Definitely it's worth giving a go because it certainly resolved my falls issue, but also the social side is really nice. Now if someone's sitting watching today, um, that's over 50 obviously watching this show, um, and they've never done any sort of strength work before with dumbbells and, and they're like, they don't know what to expect. What would you say to them? I'd say give it a go. It's two hours a week 
and you will get such, such good results from it quite quickly. You will notice the difference. Everybody should be doing it. Everybody should be doing it. All right, so what can I expect to see in the class today? Um, we'll start off with a warm up, then we'll do some work with dumbbells, mm -hmm. um, we'll do some upper body work, lower body work, and glute, oh, sorry. Um, we do have some men in the class, I must say they were outnumbered, but we do have some men in the class. Once they get in, you know, they, they enjoy it. Well, I'm looking forward to doing it, and fantastic job, well done, yes. hundreds of people now, and after this show you might have a thousand watching you on Zoom. <laughs> I'm grateful to them, Carol, because I'm a little bit like everybody else when it comes to exercising, because, but having to front up for this class twice a week, I have to do my exercises. Yes, so it keeps you at it. I'm very grateful to them for coming along and making me do it. So all they have to do anywhere in Australia, as long as they're a member of Base IG3A, yeah, that's right, yes. they can join your yeah, wonderful Balance and Bones okay. class. All right, let's get into it, shall we? Okay, okay let's. <laughs> so if someone's watching today, um, you know, that's over 60 maybe, that, that has never tried hand weights or never tried to do a balance class. What would you say to them? I know of two people who have had falls and um, I would say join because it does help you with that. The, the fact that, you know, older people can fall and that's really bad. So it does help with that as well as giving you strength. So if someone's a bit shy or a bit anxious about starting for the first time, do you have any words for those people? Who There's nothing to be shy about because we did it, um, there would have been 20 or 30 in here, but when you do it on Zoom, you're just doing it by yourself, you know? So no, start, yeah. never too late. No, no one sees you. I think you should give it a go, whoever would like to start. <laughs> awesome. Now we've just finished a balance and bones class and Wynne was in the class. Hi Wynne. Yes, yes, it was very nice. It was very good. And what makes you keep coming back and keep doing it again on Zoom? Oh, because I think exercise is very, very good for you, especially when you're over 50. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing I'm nearly 82. <laughs> Most people watching are aware that exercise is really oh, yeah. important as we get older. Mm, definitely. It's just a matter of finding that thing that you enjoy doing. You know, what benefits mm. have you noticed? I haven't fallen yet, so I don't want to fall. So I think that the balance part of it's very, very good. I love gardening and I think it helps me, you know, garden. I like walking on the beach, so it helps me sort of uh, have strength and muscle power. And, mm. and the stability on the sand yes, as well. Yes, absolutely. So how long do you think you'll keep doing it for? Hopefully until I'm 100, and that's 18 years away. <laughs> <laughs> have you got the party planned already? Yes, I have. <laughs> you, you're invited. Oh, okay, excellent. Mm. So what would you say to someone sitting at home as 82? It's an excellent idea, absolutely fantastic. And if you like Zoom, um, you don't have to get your car out and, you know, travel. Mm. So the Zoom class is good. But I like meeting people, you know, yeah. I like the socialisation of it. So I think it's excellent when you are over 50. I think it's a very, very good way to um, prevent falls and uh, enjoy life. And if you like gardening, that's terrific. If you like walking on the beach, that's marvellous. So I think it's a very, very good activity to do. So I couldn't, uh, you know, recommend it more. If you're thinking about it, stop thinking, just do it. Yes, <laughs> just do it. <laughs> right. Keep going, give it a go and don't poo-hoo it, just do it. Thanks for watching today. If you watch the show regularly, you'll know we share lots of valuable info and also have lots of fun. To get more fun in your life, you might want to check out your local U3A network. For information on any of the guests, including Mish Wright, please go to our website, carolohalloran.com. Please connect with us on Facebook, YouTube, or Insta. Keep looking when cooking, and if you see a fire, get out and stay out. As Joan Collins says, age is irrelevant. Over 50, so what? I'm Carol. Thanks for watching our TV show. Be sure to hit subscribe and then you'll never miss an episode. 
jump on Facebook, join our group, get in on the fun, fitness, wellness and inspiration. I'm Carol, over 50, so what? <laughs>